Redstone actually has been a really big help to Minecraft because Minecraft wouldn't be interesting without Redstone. It's a bit like wiring in Minecraft that you can do different circuits with and make tons of machines and it's really fun. We've made like piston doors which slide in and out and we've made clock circuits and oscilloscopes. We just finished doing logic gates. They're basically things that force the signal to do stuff, force the electricity to do things. Let's say I have a logic gate called an AND gate, and if I have two levers, I have to pull both down for the redstone to continue flowing. I quite like all their tutors. The tutors are really nice. They've made the lessons really interesting, and it can really help you if you're stuck with something. He was brilliant, really inspiring actually, and he definitely knew what he was doing with redstone. He came up with some really good challenges as well to do. I really enjoyed building the assault course. You have to try and go to the other side without getting pushed by the pistons that are rapidly pushing out. I've made an elevator. It's just a group of sticky pistons and pistons. The block that you can only use is a redstone block, and that powers both of the pistons to move it up to a certain level. I have made a house that has redstone contraptions like lights to actually turn on when you pull a lever, a door that works by itself. We've made pop-up fireplaces and we've used command blocks which can create things. People in Minecraft generally can make a lot of really good things. I just started doing redstone, I never did redstone before, but now that I've started, I am really good at it. In five days, I never knew that I could build so much. It's been a great course, I really enjoy it. One of the best I've been to.